Compass Kids. This is Mrs. Mason. I am so happy to be with you today reading the Bible with my good friend Lila. Lila, are you ready to read the Bible today? Yes, I am so ready. What book are we reading? Remind our Compass Kids friends. Oh, we are in the book of Proverbs. That's right. Are you ready to listen to today's? Oh, yes. Okay, Proverbs 14, 11 through 12. The house of the wicked will be destroyed, but the tent of the upright will flourish. There is a way that seems right to a man, but its end is the way of death. Oh, the way of death? That sounds terrible. What did the verse say will make you go that way? Because I don't want to be on the way of death. Well, when we insist on our own way, not do things God's way. It might seem like a pretty good idea at the time, but it will lead to death. Hey, I've learned about that before. Ha, it was actually from you, Miss Elise. Oh. You taught us about when David really wanted more and more wives for himself, but then even though he knew it wasn't God's way and he wanted to go on his own way and he took Bathsheba to be his wife, Sin always has a punishment, and it can be something very sad like that. That's why we have to read God's word and know what it says so that we can do things God's way and not our own way. Yeah, God knows best. His word helps us to be 